At Numerian Capital, we bring you the latest stock news each day. Please like and subscribe so we can bring these articles to you each day. Thank you. Today, November 2, 2022, Mullen Stock Alert, Mullen just eliminated $13 million of debt. Mullen now has less than $10 million of overall indebtedness. Mullen Automotive's debt elimination of $13 million is expected to save $3.5 million in interest expense. Large shareholder Asusa Holdings likely converted its convertible promissory notes into common stock. Shares of Mullen stock are down more than 90% year-to-date. Mullen Automotive, Nasdaq MULN, announced this morning that it has eliminated $13 million in debt, bringing its overall indebtedness to less than $10 million compared to over $30 million last year. The debt reduction was related to an obligation with Asusa Holdings, a major shareholder of Mullen stock. Furthermore, the debt conversion will save about $3.5 million in interest expenses per year. CEO David Mitchery added. It's been a great year for Mullen Automotive, we've made tremendous strides on all fronts, including significantly improving our financial health. Continuing our goal of being debt-free is a main focus and provides us with a strong path forward for our EV innovation and programs, securing investor confidence and overall company health. Mullen did not disclose the exact process for eliminating the debt. However, Mullen mentioned that the debt was converted, which means that Asusa may have converted its $12.94 million of convertible promissory notes into shares of common stock. Mullen eliminates $13 million in debt. The agreement with Mullen and Asusa, which is referred to as the exchange agreement, was enacted on October 14. Under the agreement, Asusa could convert its notes at the lowest daily volume weighted average price in the 10 trading days prior to conversion with a 5% discount. Asusa received the notes after Mullen defaulted on a previous obligation. On June 30, Asusa exercised notes worth $27.61 million, or 28 million shares of common stock. These notes were received as part of an original note agreement. The notes' maturity dates were extended to July 23, 2024 in accordance with an amended and restated secured convertible note and security agreement. However, Mullen couldn't fulfill the order due to limitations on authorized outstanding shares. The electric vehicle company was only able to fulfill 17.5 million shares. Therefore, it was 10.5 million shares short. Therefore, the $12.94 million of notes that Asusa received was seen as a remedy to the default. As part of the exchange agreement, Asusa agreed to cancel and extinguish and not seek to enforce any rights or interest in the A&R note. Now, it seems that the fiasco with Asusa has come to a conclusion. Still, the conversion of the notes would signify that there are now more shares of Mullen stock outstanding. That would dilute existing shareholders while lowering debt. Thanks for watching. Numerian Capital News. Please come back tomorrow for another stock news update. Thank you.